play will consistency issues impact Cooper's fantasy value? 158 Matthew Berry, Mike Clay and Matt Bowen discuss Amari Cooper's role in the Raiders' offense and if fantasy managers should be concerned. 158 June 13, 2018 During the off-season, 2,880 human beings, 32 teams x 90 players, can be rostered by an NFL team. Once week one rolls around, that number is cut down to 1,696, 32 by 53. The ESPN Fantasy Player Database includes more than 2,300 players. It's never too early to get ready for the 2018 football season. Get caught up on what the biggest off-season moves mean for fantasy purposes. Looking forward to the 2018 fantasy season? Here's a top 300 and positional rankings for PPR leagues, updated throughout the summer. You can't be expected to know all of those players, which is why the 192 is here to make your life easier. Why 192? Fantasy leagues come in all shapes and sizes, but many have settled into the vicinity of 12 teams and 16 players. The 192 is a list of the 192 players who should be drafted, and thus rostered, in a 12-team, 16-round, PPR league with relatively standard scoring and lineup settings. The players are technically listed in the order they should be drafted, though it's important to remember that drafts are fluid and your decisions should be altered based on what's left on the board and your previous selections. What if you're in an 8-team league? Or a 16-teamer? The 192 can still help you win, but you'll certainly need to make tweaks in the mid to late rounds. For example, in a smaller league, you may want to wait even longer at quarterback because the position is so deep. In deeper leagues, running backs and tight ends should be more of a priority as those positions lack depth and could leave you with a weak spot if you wait until late. At the end of the piece, I'll also include players to consider for those of you in deeper leagues. Though some player analysis is included throughout the piece, strategy is the primary topic of discussion. For more thorough player analysis, check out our player profiles, which were drawn up by yours truly. At the end of the day, this should serve as a simple guide to help you maximize the value of your starting lineup while making the best possible decision each round. One, Le'Veon Bell, Pitt, Air Bay 2. Todd Gurley the second, La, Air Bay 3, David Johnson, Ari, RB the big three at running back this year. You're sitting pretty if you land one of these every down workhorses. Four, Antonio Brown, Pitt, WR once the three elite. Every down backs are gone, Brown should be the next man off the board. He'll attempt to pace wide receivers in fantasy points for the fifth consecutive season. Five. Ezekiel Elliott, Dull, Air Bay 6. Dan Andre Hopkins, HOUWR7. Saquon Barkley, NYG, Air Bay 8. Alvin Kamara, No, RB Elliott's low target ceiling keeps him out of the top group but he's a strong bet to lead the NFL in rushing. Barkley is a rookie, and thus a bit risky, but it shouldn't be long until he's handling a workload similar to the big three. Camaro joins this deer following Mark Ingram's four-game suspension. Devante Adams is the type of player you can get late in the second round, even more reason to covet a top-five pick in drafts this year. Street Teleka slash Kitty Images 9, Julio Jones, ATL, WR10, L. Beckham Jr. NYG, WR11. Keenan Allen, Lack, WR12. Kareem Hunt, KC, Airbay 13. Dalvin Cook, Min, Airbay 14. Michael Thomas, No, WR15. Melvin Gordon, Lack, Airbay 16. Leonard Fournette, Jack, Airbay 17. AJ Green, Chin, WR18. LaShawn McCoy, Buff, Airbay 19. Christian McCaffrey, Carr, Airbay 20. Devante Freeman, ATL, Airbay 21. Devante Adams, GEB, WR22. Rob Gronkowski, Nebraska, Tay 23. Mike Evans, TB, WR. Yeah, the second round is deep. If you're able to pick your draft spot, I'd take a top three selection, land one of the elite backs and then likely have your choice of one of these players in the second, and possibly third, round. There's a fairly clear top 13 at running back this season. 
So while I'd never say force a position, I'd suggest trying to grab one of them in the first two rounds. There's a debate as to where Gronkowski should go each and every year. He was outstanding again in 2018 and, if you ask me, is the clear top tight end in fantasy. Grab him at the second slash third round turn. 24. Adam Thielen, Min, WR25. Larry Fitzgerald, Ari, WR26. Tyreek Hill, KC, WR27. T.Y. Hilton, IND, WR28. Doug Baldwin, C, WR29. Travis Kelsey, KC, T30. Zach Hertz, PHI, T31. Demary R. S. Thomas, DEN, WR32. Stefan Diggs, Min, WR33. Alan Robinson, CHI, WR34. Golden Tate, Det. WR35. Josh Gordon, CLE Ritz back to the wide receiver well as we get into the third round. These are solid, high floor, fringe top 15 options. Kelsey vs Ertz is a toss up, but both are third round options because they offer a nice edge over the remaining tight ends. 36. Jarek McKinnon, SF, Airbay 37. Joe Mixon, Chin, Airbay 38. Jordan Howard, CHI, I'll be running back it's pretty muddy once you're past the aforementioned top 13, McKinnon and the Mixon have serious efficiency question marks, but also clear paths to a massive workload. Howard is a terrific rusher, but may not give you much as a receiver. He has more value in non-PPR formats.39. Julian Edelman Nebraska, WR40, Alshon Jeffrey, PHI, WR41, Juju Smith-Schuster, Pitt, WR42. Amari Cooper, Oak, WR the fourth round offers a few back-end WR2 options.43. Rashad Penny, C, Airbay 44. Kenyon Drake, MIA, Airbay 45. Alex Collins, Bell, Airbay 46. Darius Geis, Was, Airbay 47. J. Ajayi, PHI, Airbay 48. Sony Michelle, Nebraska, Airbay 49. Royce Freeman, DEN, Airbay 50. Ronald Jones 2, TB. RB, this is a frontier with loads of youth and upside, but it's also easy to pick holes in each of these players, with Penny, Geis, Michelle, Freeman, and Jones joining up with Barkley. A hefty 12% of our top 50 is comprised of rookie running backs. That may seem too optimistic, but early round backs haven't had trouble finding their way into hefty workloads in recent years. You're obviously throwing a dart at upside here, so I wouldn't fault anyone for fading their second running back slot and instead loading up elsewhere. Emmanuel Sanders could be quite the value pick this year, when you consider the upside he offers along with the arrival of Case Keenum at QB. Ron Chain or USA Today Sports 51 Jarvis Landry, CLEWR 52 Marvin Jones Jr., Det, WR 53 Robert Woods, La, WR 54 Emmanuel Sanders, DENWR Speaking of which, if you do, in fact, want to avoid running backs in this spot, here are the rest of the top 24 wide receivers. Sanders stands out as a terrific value in the mid to late rounds of early 2018 drafts. 55. Marshawn Lynch, O, Airbay 56. Mark Ingram, No, Airbay 57. Derek Henry, 10, Airbay 58. Don Lewis, 10, Airbay 59. Duke Johnson Jr., CLE Airbay 60. Pierre Garçon, SF. WR61. Michael Crabtree, Bell, WR62. Brandon Cooks, La, WR63. Corey Davis, 10, WR. These players nearly round out the top 30 at both running back and wide receiver, which is especially notable for those of you in 10 team leagues. Ingram would be inside the top 40 if not for a four game suspension to start the season. Davis underwhelmed as a rookie, but his elite upside makes him well worth a sixth round pick. 64. Aaron Rodgers, GEB, QB 65. Tom Brady, Nebraska, QB. The sixth round is where we find our first quarterbacks. Why the long wait? First, we haven't been short on top end, or potentially top end, talent through our first 60 or so players, and second, the position is as deep as ever. As you'll see later, 
and average draft position shows, you can address other, more important positions early and often and still come away with a solid or better quarterback.66. Chris Hogan Nebraska, WR67. Sammy Watkins, KC, WR68. Cooper Cup, La, WR69. Devin Funches, Carr, WR70. Devante Parker, MIA, WR71. Mendel Cobb, GEB, WR72. Will Fuller V, HOUWR73. Greg Olson, Carr, TAY74. Delaney Walker, 10, TAY75. Evan Engram, NYG, TAY76. Lamar Miller, HOUEBA77. Kelvin Benjamin, Buff. WR78, Jamison Crowder, was, WR79. Kerry on Johnson, Det, I'll be finding a competent no, three wide receiver won't be hard this year, as the sixth and seventh rounds are loaded with options, and even some nice upside. This is also a good place to land a solid tight end. Miller may seem low since he has upside in Houston's offense, but his shaky efficiency has put his job in doubt. 80. Cam Newton, Carr, QB81. Carson Wentz, PHI, QB82. Russell Wilson, C, QB83. Deshaun Watson, HOU QB84. Gordon Reed, was, D. E. The seventh round may be too late to land some, if not all, of these quarterbacks in casual leagues. But that's okay, you'll have similar options later. Reed has been too great when healthy to risk he waiting any longer. 85. Tevin Coleman, ATL, Air Bay 86. Tarek Cohen, CHI, Air Bay 87. Chris Thompson, was, Air Bay 88. Dashawn Jackson, TB, WR 89. Robbie Anderson, Nige, WR 90. Jimmy Graham, GEB, TA 91. Jordy Nelson, Oak, WR 92. Marquise Goodwin, SF, WR 93. Des Bryant, FA, WR94. Isaiah Crowell, Nige, Airbay95. Jamal Williams, GEB, Airbay96. Rex Burkhead, Nebraska, Airbay97. Dante Foreman, HOU Airbay98. Marlon Mack, INT Airbay99. Kyle Rudolph, Min, T100, Aaron Jones, GEB. I'll be the 8th round includes high floor scatbacks, lead back dart throws, solid tight end options and fringe starters at wide receiver. Sterling Shepard's potential is exciting, but he also supplies a very stable floor. Eric Hartline USA Today Sports 101 Marquise Lee, Jack, WR102 Sterling Shepard, NYG, WR103 Kenny Stills, MIA, WR104. Nelson Aguilar, PHI, WR105. Rashad Matthews, 10, WR106. Josh Dotson, was, WR107. Bilal Powell, Nige, Airbay108. Nick Chubb, CLE Airbay109. Carlos Hyde, CLE Airbay110. Jack Doyle, INT Tay 111. Thray Burton, CHI, Tay 112. Giovanni Bernard, Chin, Airbay 113. Devon T. Booker, DN Airbay 114. CJ Anderson, Carr, Airbay 115. Alan Hearns, Dull, WR 116. Paul Richardson, was, at this point, you're simply adding depth and upside to your bench. 117. Ben Roethlisberger, Pitt, QB 118. Kirk Cousins, Min, QB 119. Andrew Luck, INT QB 120. Tyler Reifert, Chin, TE. Here are three more quarterback options and a Hail Mary at tight end. Luck has been a top 5 fantasy quarterback when healthy, so I'll move him up if his week 1 availability clears up. Made no mistake, he shouldn't simply be crossed off your draft board. He's too good. 121. Kenny Golladay, Det, WR122. Muhammad Sanu, ATL, WR123. Martavis Bryant, Oak, WR124. DJ Moore, Carr, WR125. 
Tyler Lockett, C. WR126. Calvin Ridley, ATL, WR127. Matthew Stafford, Det, QB128. Drew Brees, No, QB129. Cameron Meredith, No, WR130. Anthony Miller, CHI, WR131. Christian Kirk, Ari, WR132. Michael Gallup, Dull, WR133. Jordan Matthews, Nebraska, WR134. Albert Wilson, MIA, WR135. James Washington, Pitt, WR136. John Ross, Chin, WR137. Zay Jones, Buff, WR138. Mike Williams, Lack, we are getting to the late stages here, so it's time to start thinking high upside flyers. Rookies Moore, Ridley, Miller, Kirk, Gallup and Washington were all picked in the early rounds and have a path to a top 3 gig in 2018. Ross, Jones and Williams are terrific second year post hype targets. You can wait at quarterback and still come away with talent and incredible upside, like Patrick Mahomes. Kyle Emery slash Icon Sports Y 139. Theo Redick, Det, Airbay 140. James White, Nebraska, Air Bay 141. Charles Clay, Buff, Tay 142. Philip Rivers, Lack, QB 143. Patrick Mahomes, KC, QB 144. Kenneth Dixon, Bell, Air Bay 145. Jordan Wilkins, IND Air Bay 146. Latavius Murray, Min, Air Bay 147. David Njoku, CLET 148, Jameis Winston, TB, QB 149, Jimmy Garoppolo, SF, QB 150, Matt Breda, SF, Airbay 151, Ty Montgomery, GEB, Airbay 152, Chris Carson, C, Airbay 153, LeGarrette Blunt, Det, RB tight end gets a bit shaky after the top 9, which is why you shouldn't be afraid to wait a while if you miss out on one of those options, Clay, Solid, and Njoku, Upside, are fine targets here. We also start to get into backup quarterback options. I don't generally recommend carrying two, but there are some variables that make it more justifiable in 2018. You shouldn't be picking one too early because of the available talent at other positions. Some top-end quarterbacks have injury question marks, including Wentz, Watson, and Luck. The position's depth means you should be taking shots on high ceiling passes knowing you have viable fallback options. There are many breakout options at the position, including Mahomes, Garoppolo, and Mitchell Trubisky.154. Jacksonville Jaguars DST I try to wait until the final two rounds to take my defense and kicker, or avoid taking them at all if league rules allow it. But the Jaguars D slash ST was dominant last season and is just as good on paper again in 2018.155. Cameron Brait, TB. Tay 156. Terence Williams, Dull, WR157. Ted Ginn Jr., No, WR158. Dante Moncrief, Jack, WR159. Neheim Hines, IND Airbay 160. Alex Smith, Was, QB161. Marcus Mariota, 10, QB162. Daph Prescott, Dull, QB 163. Matt Ryan, ATL, QB 164. George Kittle, SF, Tay 165. Mike Wallace, PHI, WR 166. Austin Safarian Jenkins, Jack, Tay 167. Peyton Barber, TB, Airbay 168. Jared Goff, La, QB 169. Mitchell Trubisky, CHI, QB aside from kicker and D slash street. This concludes the list of players who should be drafted slash rostered in 12 team leagues. If you're picking in this area and feel good about your quarterback and or tight end situation, the likes of Chris Godwin, Danny Armendola and Darren Sproles just missed the cut and could make more sense for your bench. 170.
Philadelphia Eagles D slash ST171. Los Angeles Rams D slash ST172. Minnesota Vikings D slash ST173. Houston Texans D slash ST174. Baltimore Ravens D slash ST175. Greg Zerline, La, K176. Steven Gostkowski, Nebraska, K177. Justin Tucker, Bell, K178. New England Patriots D slash ST179. Los Angeles Chargers D slash ST180. Denver Broncos D slash ST181. Carolina Panthers D slash ST182. New Orleans Saints D slash ST183. Tennessee Titans D slash ST184. Matt Bryant, ATL, K185. Will Lutz, No, K186. Chris Boswell, Pitt, K187. Robbie Gould, SF, K188. Jake Elliott, PHI, K189. Matt Prater, Det, K190. Harrison Butker, KC, K191. Adam Vinatari, IND K192. Graham Gano, Car, Careful mentioned Jaguars D slash SD aside, these are your top 12 options at Kicker and D slash Street. Is it smart to pick these players around earlier in order to get an edge on the competition? I'm fine with that if it's an elite option, but those are few and far between. You're better off just taking the best available in the final two rounds and streaming them based on matchup. Just missed the cut. QB, Tyrod Taylor, Andy Dalton, Derek Carr, Case Keenum Air Bay, Darren Sproles, Frank Gore, Doug Martin, Austin Nicola, Elijah Maguire, Mark Walton, John Kelly WR, Chris Godwin, Danny Armendola, Brandon Marshall, John Brown, Willie Sneed, D.D. Westbrook, Tyrell, Williams, Ryan Grant, Quincy Anunwa, Jermaine Curse, Taewan Taylor Day, Benjamin Watson, Vance McDonald, Mike Jessicki, Jared Cook, Dan Bailey, Ryan Sucker, Daniel Carlson, Josh Lambode slash ST, Redskins, Cardinals, Cowboys, Seahawks to help make this website better, to improve and personalize your experience and for advertising purposes, are you happy to accept cookies and other technologies? More info here.